gimmick of the 16 news on November the 3rd. Yes, it's November. The year is flying by so fast. It's not even funny. Um, first, let's get into some cassette news. A lot of people are backlashing about Ricky's newest design on his, um, one of his, like, clutch purses he made. And there's a swastika on it. But he made an honest mistake. He's human. Come on, guys. Just leave him alone. He, humans make mistakes, and he's not a robot. So, please stop bashing him over Twitter because of it. He made a mistake. Other than that, um, he also made the entire band wear his new clothes that he made. They're, Kai's wearing um, too young, or too fast to live, or die young, or something like that. I have to look it up, but... Rich is wearing the, um, like, parka slash hoodie he made. Right, um, Ricky's wearing, like, the, his dim scene, um, like, dim scene plaid shirt he has. Um, Owie's wearing the black version of it, just the black one. Yuda's wearing the other shirt that comes with the, um, thing. He made a lighter slash cigarette pack. Um... It comes with two lighters. I am not getting that. I I don't smoke, but I'm not getting it because my mom and my my family smokes. If I if they see lighters, they will be gone. So I'm not getting that yet. Um, what else? Um, he has new nex necklaces, uh, new more little clutch purses, um, iPhone cases. Um, I think. What else? What else? I think he has like a br new bracelet. Also, the like um, padlock necklace my friend's been looking for. It's back in stock, but it's Hershey member only. I will probably find someone that can make custom make um, a padlock that's the same padlock Ricky had during. Um, I think it was. One before Boko Dawn. Um, I can't remember what the damn name of it. It's, um, when they were doing the Rayla tour. Oh, crap. What was the name of it? It's going to drive me insane until I remember it. Um, in X Japan news, Yoshiki has been busy as hell. Um, he's been um, promoting his new comic that just come um came out blood red dragon he was at stanley's comic con in san diego over the weekend he was at a hello kitty con also this weekend um doing a new theme for hello kitty and i watched it and it was really cute and he kind of put like a techno remix into it it was funny um but they are. They might be coming back to MSG. I don't know because I'm getting spammed from the MSG um, people, like the group. I will die if they come back to uh, Madison Square Garden once my YouTube is going up. Um, let's see what else. Screw is on tour. Uh, oh, the Gazette is going on tour tomorrow. Um, the I couldn't find the earlier dates on their site yet, but they are going on tour starting tomorrow. Their first shows to well today. Um, Owie's basically Ricky went on around about type B. He does not like type B, B blood types. Um, and now he replied something about like why why all of a sudden the blood, type B blood types are getting bashed, and you say wait. He said something about pickies. Hold on. Um. A a type um. Nah. A type no. Well. Well. Pickies are cute. <laughs> Piggy. And um. Rach has been very active on Twitter along with Owie. I guess I was just needed a break from Twitter because of fucking like spam he get spams he gets and stuff. I understand. Um, that's the same thing with me. Like, at um. Anyways, let's get into a news that happening this week and the weekend of November that happened. I do not feel like going back in October because it's like 
way too many pages and I don't like keep pausing my videos. Let's see. Um, Div has released a new album, Secret, and will be released on February the 25th, 2015. Details have been announced. The band has a new look. New look for Fest Fikur. Uh, OG has postponed their new maxi single, Kogomae. Um, the new release of the CD will be postponed. Other details are not have been uh, yet announced. New look for the band. I released two digital singles. Uh, the two digital singles are Bless You and Brand New World will be released on the 31st of December. Well, that's one way to get him. Um, Kadame Tairu Tasuki has a new album. Their second album, Day Zipper. Daisy Zipper has released a new maxi single, Arrest. Um, the White Man Live Winter Disorder at Nogari ELL on the 2nd, well, yesterday. Arrest has been, will be released on the 21st of January of next year. Type AB 1620 in. Include CD and DVD. Including Arrest, the PV, Music Slip, and the Making of. And Type B will be 1080 yen and CD only. Kori Kuriyuri Tukage has released a new single and an album. They released Yosh Yoku Kairu. I'm totally pronouncing that wrong. At Ikebaru Edge. Yesterday, the new mess single, Yoshiku Gasuki Masai Masui, Eek. will be released on the 3rd of December. It'll be 1,620 yen and limited to 99 cell, 99 only. Uh, their full album, Hinku, Hinkai no, Hinku Nai Tano. Tano Hasuki Nami uh, will be released on February the 11th and be 3,459 56 yen. It will include CD only. Or CD plus DVD. Single preview of Raid's Rebellion that is going to be well, it's not ow, itchy. Do, 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 do. New look for Day Diz Daisy Zipper. Oh. Um, Bislip, Doctor Teddy, Salvage, Mister Invisible. New look for F E S. Lightbringer will be on a definite hiatus and releasing a live DVD. Um, will be on hiatus the D in December. Their live DVD title has not been announced, but it'll be released sometime in December. Details have yet been announced. Uh, comments from Karu, Kai, Kairu? Uh, Marvel Momo Maru bleh, will be on pause the live performance <sighs> since their live at Takodona Baba Arena at well, to well, tomorrow for us and today in Japan. It, due to mental illness, he will expect to resume performing back on the 18th of this month. New band Datarama. Um, Solid Rain will be departing and will be on hiatus. We'll be departing on the birth of Shinjuku on the 18th of this due, of this month due to personal reasons, and the bands will be on a hiatus after that. Heroes return to indie after a major debut on the in last year. They will announce on the 1st of November. Well, already passed. I'm sorry, I missed this. Um, that Hero will be returning. 
their major indie release after their New Mexico single, Zero, of be released, has already been released on the 22nd of October. By the way, they will be holding a One Man Live retire, retry since Tassio West on, Feb, on Valentine's Day of next year up to their tour semifinals at the East on the wait, July. Yeah, the 5th of July. Uh, their tour finals will be sometime in December of next year. Um, new look for 4960 plus new members. They got a new guitar, new guitar, well, rhythm guitar, and a DJ and three new members. <laughs> a DJ sampler and a new, there are new members. So they got two new guitars and a new DJ and slash sampler. 4960 changed their band name after the parting of Kuru and their vocal Kini and Saki on the Shuki on the 11th of June. Four members, four new members have joined 405, 4960 Skull at September the 5th, they changed their brand name to 4960 on the same date, their new lineup, their first secret live. On the 13th of this month, their first demo of the live birth at Sinjuku will be released on 12, the 12th of December. Their present live will be on January the 27th of next year year. Buck Trick has released a new album, Akunohana. Um, Akunohana be their 2015 mixed version will be released on the 1st of February of next month. Um, the Platinum SHM CD edition will be 3,780 yen slash Blu-ray edition will be 6,000 264 yen and DVD edition will be 5,184 yen. The Morio box with complete works will be released on the 1st of February. It will be 14,904 yen. Holy shit, that is a lot of money. <laughs> new look for Advent Chick. Uh, new PV to your heart. Um, from the same band. Uh, new PV from Sick of Power of Two. Kikashiku Kasuri? Kaisai? Well, Graham Wick will reveal the new track. New Max single. Um, new Max single will be released on the 24th of December. Um, Lazimas has a new support bass player. Uh, Vampire Rose support. They will support the bass player at Ikebaro Cyber on the 16th of December. Uh, that, I don't know if that actually counts as video, okay. Well, anyways, I think, wait, I think there's more news, hold on. Oh, that reminds me, there is a He Day birthday party happening. And I wish I could go. I really do. Because it'd be so much fun actually being there and watching he did things. Because I see some like really cool like pictures of him in like a Santa Claus outfit. It was, he's so cute. Why is he so cute? Um, for a, a rock legend of Visual K. He's so fucking cute. Um, and he's hyper, so <laughs> that's probably why my friend likes him because she could, she dyed her hair like him. And anyways, I'm rambling. Um, what else? Oh, that reminds me, there is finally a video for um, 
the festival, the Gazette performed at Kishibakudu. I, I'm sorry, I cannot pronounce it. But there is video out, and it's the full performance. And it's I know it's basically a lot of people think they play more songs, but festivals usually have a strict time limit of like 45 minute sets, so or 35 minutes because they play Malcolm Box, um, Inside the Beast, Slu Sludge and Guilt, Sludgy Guilt, uh, and Tomorrow Never Dies. That's four songs. Oh no, wait, five I think. And Malform Box Inside the Beast, um, Sludge Guilt, and Tomorrow Never Dies. So that's four songs. That e that roughly equals around 35 minutes. And well, it's saying 14 minutes, but it's actually probably about like 35. So that's why a lot of people thought it'd be like an actual full concert. They're playing at a festival, and there's other bands playing after them. So they have to basically show basically perform, get off stage, and their crew takes all their equipment off. And so that's why a lot of people are kind of confused about it, but it's a festival. They have a strict time limit. I've been to a few fe music festivals, and I understand how it works really easily because their performance, they basically play in a full set, then they are going to leave. So, yeah. It is the full performance that last year, not I think like 2013, 2012, they end with Tomorrow Never Dies, and I think it's Tomorrow Never Dies when they when it actually ended, their set ended, and they did the same thing for 2000 and um, this year 2014. So basically. It's the full performance, including their little interview at the beginning with the guy that made it. He's also in the band. I do want to go see it. And he's complimenting about, like, our... We kind of like to hit bang. It's true, we do, we do. I do find myself drumming along with Kai because, hell, why not? And my last right leg was numb as hell last night because I was actually drumming like I was hitting the bass drum. And my leg was sore as fuck. Anyways, I am rambling on. And tomorrow's going to be a vlog. And it's going to be basically going to complain about the cold. Anyways, people, just leave Ricky alone. It's There's just not right to bash him about this. There's like three different swastikas. Really, there is. There's the Nazi one, the Buddhist one, and the Hindu one. So, stop bashing on him. He's just a human being, not a god or a robot that's perfect. He's human. Human people make mistakes. So don't bash on him anymore. That's all I'm asking. Because right now, he's already probably under stress being going on tour tomorrow or well on tour right now. I think they're probably driving, I don't know. But I will probably keep you updated on how the tour's going. Um Ricky and Rita, and now we're probably going to tweet like sh crazy about their shows. So I probably will have a lot of new, um, like, information what's going on with the tour. So look out for Gazette's last tour for this year. And I'm still trying to decipher what he's talking about and about working on new songs. We might get a new CD and hopefully another tour. Hopefully the tour will be in the States. That'd be amazing. Because me and my friend are like trying our damnedest to... Uh, I'm rambling so. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's a vlog. If you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe, leave, and share with your friends. All that, all that stuff. Um, never regret something made you smile once. And happy November. Let's make this fun because... Uh, why not? It's almost the end of the year. Um... Let's go with a bang. What do you say? Jane.